short and sweet. Linda Snyder. Fellow Toastmasters, honored judges, and welcome guests. Short but sweet. That's the story of my little older brother's life. This month is his birthday, and he was born about two years before me. And for a long time as I was growing up, my parents said, we wouldn't have had you if your brother hadn't died. And it didn't sound like exactly the way that they wanted to put it. <laughs> but it turned out as I grew older and figured it out, that my mother had almost died in childbirth. She'd lost a child, and six months later, she had intentionally conceived me. How loved is that? Meanwhile, I had an older brother. He died at birth and was buried with a grandfather because the family had no money even for burial and my, and my father's wife was dying at the time. And so for four days, he didn't tell her that her son had died and had to keep that secret to himself. But that child was loved by my mother, loved by my father, and loved by me because I know that in some ways I am here because of that. And as we cleaned out my mother's house because she moved into a condominium and now she has passed away, I found the baby book for my brother. It begins with, congratulations, you're having a baby. And you go on to the next page and congratulations, you've had a child. And you go on to the next page and it says, get well, because my mother was so ill. And the final page is about sympathy. It says, so sorry for your loss. So this was a child that was alive for only a matter of minutes, but his life touched so many and changed so many lives. It was short but sweet. <laughs> 